Hey guys, my name is Felicia and welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna share with you how I'm spending one day in my life during the lockdown, so keep on watching. After having a good sleep, I'm getting up from bed and I'm having a big glass of water with lemon juice. Most probably you already know the benefits from the lemon water. I would shortly describe as a good hydration with a good dose of the vitamin C in it, which helps to improve your skin quality, detoxify your body and get your digestive system moving. Then after that, I'm getting myself ready for fasted cardio, which is obviously walking up the stairs from the building that I live in right now. It usually takes me 30 minutes to do 62 floors all the way up and 62 floors all the way down. If you would ask me what's my favorite type of cardio, then uh, definitely my answer would be walking up the stairs. And I'm so happy that even during this lockdown, I can still do it. Straight after that, being back home, I'm having my BCA for muscle recovery. This is Genius Nutrition BCA X5 in my favorite flavor, which is Leche. Sadly, this is the view that we are having for the last two weeks, the empty JBR no living soul walking around the only one thing moving on the beach right now is the police car checking if everyone is respecting the rules after a hot cold shower i'm getting ready and i spend all my mornings in this cute pyjama that I got from misguided shop in Dubai mall. It has like a certain material that makes me feel cozy and chic at the same time. It's time for breakfast now and I'm looking forward to cook my oatmeal. For this I'm going to need quaker oats, a little bit less than one cup. I'm cooking them with one cup of coconut milk and one cup of water. Then I'm adding some cinnamon and stevia. Then I'm adding half a cup of frozen berries. I have raspberries, but you can use anything you like. Even dried foods works well with oats. In the meanwhile, I'm preparing my super green smoothie. And first of all, I'm adding the juice from one lemon. One big celery stick goes in, cut in pieces one big handful of kale leaves ginger like this much i love the spicy taste it gives to the smoothie then i'm adding two cups of coconut water along with stevia as i like this smoothie to be mild sweet and of course please don't forget ice cubes five to six ice cubes because it will make a very big difference trust me Let's blend everything with my magic nutri board. And here it is, less than 40 calorie smoothie. Super green, beauty smoothie, power smoothie, call it as you want. Very rich in fiber and antioxidants, very refreshing. You should definitely try it out. Coming back to my oats, which were cooking for about 5 minutes now, you can see they are cooked when they get thicker and soft. Now half a scoop of whey protein goes in, you can use again your favorite one, then one rich teaspoon of nut butter, today I'm using this cashew butter. When everything is mixed in, I am pouring it into a bowl, adding some extra cinnamon and some fresh blackberries and finishing it with the last retouch, a drizzle of healthy syrup mix of maple and agave. And here you go, healthy dessert with high quality macros and rich in flavor. Last but not least, of course, of course, it's coffee. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I love coffee. <laughs> And what I miss the most during this lockdown is my Arabica flat white, which I always get on the daily basis. 
definitely the best coffee in Dubai so far. But at home we go for a basic one, which is a shot of Nespresso Espresso and some cold coconut milk on top. Nothing fancy about it, but this is how I like it. And that's guys my daily breakfast. I need a comfy place to work efficiently. The sofa is my best friend. Here I can eat, have my coffee, work on my laptop, having meeting calls, sending the emails. This is what I'm doing pretty much until late afternoon. But of course I'm taking breaks during it and what I usually like doing is getting changed in my sports outfit and do some stretching for about half an hour. Some of you most probably know that I don't enjoy stretching and I'm not a big fan of it, but I'm trying to improve myself and this lockdown made me finally start it. Yes, I started working more on my flexibility. But talking about improving skills and having plenty amount of time, I love trying new recipes, cooking new stuff, spending lots of my time in the kitchen, especially because I have a person who loves food as much as I do. It's a different motivation when you get to cook for someone and watch them enjoying it, see the happiness on their face, and yeah, kitchen is definitely one of the places where you experience a lot of emotions. Now, if you don't know the current situation in Dubai, where I'm actually based, here is a complete lockdown. But if you need to do your groceries or go to pharmacy by car or by walk, you have to apply online for the permit and wait for a confirmation to actually go outside. Even getting the groceries will not be an easy job. You gotta wear your mask and gloves and stay in a long queue to get inside the Carrefour and get your body temperature checked at the entrance of it. Being finally back home after long shopping, I am looking forward to my second workout. Now, apart from the cardio session that I'm doing in the morning, I still lift heavy at home. Today I was down for a back workout. I'm still trying to keep it high repetitions as my goal is to stay toned and maintain the current shape. But anyway, I'm still using challenging dumbbells and doing all type of rows, including the rows at this multifunctional machine called Monster G3. All the Smith machine exercises here, all cable exercises possible, using 2, 5, 10, 20 kg plates. Super, super happy about that. After having a great session, I'm doing some spa things while taking the shower. Love using minty masks, which give a super refreshing and cooling effect to my scalp. I also love doing body peeling once in a week and exfoliate my legs two, three times a week with a coffee and sugar-based scrub that boosts the blood circulation, keeps them toned, exfoliates the skin and makes it super smooth and soft. Let's get cozy because now it's movie time. This is when I'm having also my post-workout meal, which is salmon with broccoli or asparagus other days it can be any other fish or beef with vegetables. Usually I don't snack, but because I'm having a pet influencer next to me, um, when we are down for the movie, I go for this one. The good thing about watching movies with Mike is that he always has something to bring on the table. And we keep on commenting the action going on in the movie. We share our impressions, sometimes you are even getting off track and then we laugh and like, we laugh a lot. I really enjoy getting in that good energy until late night to be honest. So it's so much fun to do all these things together. 
Well, this is pretty much everything I'm doing in one day during the lockdown. I really hope that you guys are taking care of yourself during this time. I would not say it's hard time, neither easy time, but it's a big challenge. It's very important to be flexible and to adapt to any environment that we get into. In my situation, the lockdown helped me to love myself more and finally start doing the things that I kept on postponing all this time because of the main excuse, not having enough time. Everyone has this excuse anyway. But now, finally, just now we've got this. The luxury of having time. It's just a matter of how you're using it and how you invest in it. And that's a very rare opportunity that maybe we will not have it anymore. Start appreciating time spent with close people to you or even if you are living alone, start loving yourself more. At the end of the day, you are the only one person who can change your habits, your lifestyle, your mood and even make yourself happy. That's all guys. Let me know in the comments what you want to see next in my video and if you liked watching this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more useful and interesting stuff for yourself be happy and stay safe